Can you tell me a little bit about the movie? Sure. Uh, the film is about a scientist, a um, backyard scientist, a man who lives in this house on his own and basically has been studying for the majority of his life. These small creatures, this kind of uh, infrastructure of creatures that lives within the back garden, particularly the leaf men, uh, who I play one of, and then their adversaries, the Boggins. The leaf men are the force of good and the Boggins are the force of evil. And this scientist who's been searching them has become kind of distant from his daughter and she comes to visit and then she gets shrunk and she goes into the little world that he's been studying for years and um, adventure and mayhem ensues and father and daughter become reconciled towards the end. And How about your character? Can you relate to him? Can I relate to him? Uh, I don't know. Um, you always can relate to everything. You find themes in, in almost anything that you can draw correlations between between the character and your own life, you know? What message do you think this movie could, kids could take out from this movie? Uh, put down the iPad and the iPhone and get out there in nature and geez, grab a stick and throw it up into the chestnut tree. And, and um, I think, if anything, Chris had alluded to that, I think once or twice, saying that, you know, that when he was a kid, you know, there wasn't the... The amount of, of technology wasn't in the grip of the information age like it is now and all this instant gratification with electronic, you know, Game Boys and all that kind of stuff. Um, that he would hope that this would inspire maybe kids to get out in nature a little bit more. That'd be cool. Yeah. So um, how different do you s would you think it's acting from just using your voice? It's the same thing, kind of, without the, let's say the pressure, but without the need to... I mean, you still... I mean, you're kind of locked. There's, there's more of the imagination, maybe. Or you just don't have as much to play off or play against. The environment isn't there. You're in a s small studio with a microphone like this and, and not working with any of the other actors. Mm -hmm. So it's a, it's, a, it's a much less naturalistic environment to work in than it is on films or even in a, in a theatre doing the stage play. Um, but fun because of that. I mean, that in itself made it specifically its own experience. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you.